Hello, welcome back to Into the Veil. This is Rachel. I thought I would bring you some place that I consider special. Um, this is a public place, but historically it was a berry farm. Um, there's a huge amount of ground here. We've actually been here in times past uh, metal detecting, and that's how we found it. And we come across a lot of false signals out here. The ground will sound off that there's something there and there's nothing there, which very seldom, if ever, happens. Um, back in the 1850s, when it was a farm, there was a young couple here. Um, then later, during the Civil War, there was um, a medical hospital instated either at the house or here on the property. We're not 110% sure. But first thing when I came out here, I took the rods out. Um, I'm gonna put them. Let's see if I can get up to behave. And just asked if, I hope you can see this, um, just asked if there were discarnate energies out here and they're seeking and it's giving me a yes if I ask where they're seeking again there's a strong pull to my right and then almost exactly directly in front of me. So what I'm thinking is that we may walk a little ways and see um, the EMF reader that we have with us is actually built into the phone. I don't know just exactly how reliable it is. We have used it out in the woods searching for Sasquatch and it seems to be um, even there at the house testing it, it, it's working against the electronics in the way that it should. Uh, we also have the rods. I did bring the pendulum, although I don't think I need it. There's a ghost app. When we asked if there were any entities out here, the first word that came up on that was soldiers. Which we thought was interesting. So we may start and stop as we walk because there's actually a lot of ground out here and minimal light. Um, we may have to, you know, kind of stop the video a little bit rather than walking you through the dark. If it feels right, we'll take you right along with us. I'm hoping that maybe we'll get lucky. We might catch some orbs, maybe some more communication on this. Um, we'll just see what happens because I don't know what to expect. And this is a public location. It is. There are houses that sit around the outer fringe of this area, so you will see some of the pole lights and porch lights and things like that. But and a ro road right, right alongside of it. But there's about 140 acres here to walk around on so we've got some room to expand and explore but we're gonna follow the rods and follow the ghost box and see if we find anything and historically I did see that this location was in line with uh, Camden's March out of the Little Rock area it went all the way I mean it was a huge March long history behind that but it could well be that it was involved in that same march maybe another um, but we'll just see ladies and gentlemen we just turned the ghost box back on getting ready to walk the grounds and the very next word that came up was homicide, homicide and mother and mother Ooh. All right. There may be several different things here. It's old ground. There's a lot of history here. It's hard to tell what might pop up. If you 
want to turn the volume up on that, it'll kind of let you hear when it's getting ready to spike onto another word so we can follow along with it a little. I saw that the bars change a little different than what I'm used to. focus a little and see if I can't do my Swami Pastrami and, and invite any energies that are here to communicate. The rods kept showing off over into this grove. This side? Yeah, this grove area. And straight up on this hill. And I'll be up on that hill. And that hill is where we kept getting the worst of the false signals, but over there too. That's interesting. We can start either way. All right, if there's anybody here that would like to be here. Nope, we got the car. other light on so they can hopefully see a little bit. Well, at least it's easier walking than we're used to. Hold that for a second and we'll get these routes back out. Okay, let's start with the homicide. Was there a homicide here? I'm gonna get it. Oh yes. energy here from that homicide. Yes. What direction should we go? Okay, we're heading the right way. Next word that came up on this is clutter. Press and clutter. Maybe we're, there's something cluttered around, I don't know. I'm just holding the rods to see if they change direction, but we're just going straight up here. Is this a female or a female? Yes. Says, meet us. Meet you where? Tell me where we'll meet you. Go right a little bit. Oh, I'm just getting showered left and right. We're not far. Is that kind of peculiar to find that here? Uh huh. Look, <laughs> look familiar? Yeah. Everywhere we go. <laughs> All right. Hundred and forty acres and what do we run across? <laughs> Thank you. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be ungrateful. All right. Is this the mother that I'm speaking with? Yes. Wait, yes. Is it the mother that was killed? 
No. Speak up, please, so the microphone can hear. I was asking if it was the mother that I was speaking with, and it's giving me a yes. I asked if it was the mother that was killed, and it's giving me a no. Did the mother do the killing? Yes? No. Oh. Okay. And you're here. Okay. Point the way. next words that came up on this are, why me? And I'm just getting the goosebumps again. <laughs> Alright. And usually for me, goosebumps are It is spiked in yeah, the right red. We're close. We're right on it. Because I, I am showered. It is completely spiked. And I am ice cold. Like, my skin just feels like I took an ice bath. All right, Mama. Well, I can see clutter and debris over here on the ground. Like, garbage bags and stuff have been dumped. Oh, is that where you're at? It says Daddy on here now. Oh. So, is Was that... Was there more than one? Was there more than one of you? Yes. Is it where the trash is? Yes, but it's light. Like, it's not trash trash. Is this a recent... Is this a recent event? Yes. Thank you, please stop. Is this within the last 10 years? Yes. If there's a way that you can communicate the years, sorry, my arm had a cramp. If you can communicate the year through the box. This is Anthony. Is. The name Anthony just came up on the screen. He says yes. Thank you, please stop. Well, it's a very, very brushy area all along the fringe of this here. It could be a good place Have to... Have they found you? Yes. So they've been found. But there hasn't been a house here in the last 10 years. That's what I'm trying to pinpoint. Of course, time for them is... Yeah, they don't measure time the way that we do in this plane. Is it here in this park? It's pausing like... Like it's not... Sh like she's not... Sh her. Is this the, still the mother? Yes, okay. Mama, are we in the right spot? She's going to a yes, but there's so much reservation, it's almost like she's just it not sure. Just had another word come up that says foul. As in foul play? Yes. 
and there were more than one of you involved? It says find us. Oh. You haven't been found? It says count. Count? What am I counting, Mama? Alright, take me to the spot. Where are we looking? Will we find any evidence of you here? back during the daytime so we can really see well. Alright, Mama, if you can cross the rods when we get to the spot you want us in, that would help me. Are we going the right direction? Are we going the right direction? It says embark. Embark. Just swung a little bit to my right. Is it here on this property? There's houses across the street too. Oh, it's giving me a no. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. Let's clear the air here. Is it? Is it here on this property? It says need you. Oh, I'm trying. It says no, like it's close. Something's happened. Maybe near where these houses are, or I well, think I would feel better being back out here during the daytime and doing this. Knowing what I know about that side street over there, it's pretty rough. Possibly. And there's a lot of clutter around those houses, and it's just not a mm, yes, not a good place. Okay, Mama, so we're going to come back to visit with you, okay? Yes. We won't forget it. So it's WARN, W-A-R-N. Yes, okay. We won't, we won't forget it. But you know we can't go walking up there at night, no less. We want to help you. Well, apparently this is going to be an investigation into another... Angle of... Another angle of... Seems to be the way we fall into stuff. I'm going to do some research too. I'm going to get street names and see if there's been anybody found or anything, I, you know. And this is not a first time experience for us. We have worked with police departments in helping them find yeah. missing bodies before. What I really need to find out is if they ever were found. And if not, then to make sure they are found. Yeah, this definitely needs a little hands-on research and see if we can find out anything about the name <coughs> Anthony or about some kind of a family homicide event or anything like that. Is there anything else, Mom? Yes, no, yes. How many of you involved? Was there one? Is there two? No, wait a minute. There's more. There's always more. What do you need us to know? Maybe you can speak to the box easier. Three gone. Three. Was one young, a baby, a little one? Says home. A little one. There was a little one involved. I don't know if somebody was pregnant. Yes. Okay. What? What else? Is there anything else? It's spiking really hard right now. All the grids are getting ready to say something. Wheat? I don't know. 
unless it was trying to say something else that sounds like wheat. Is that what you meant to say? No. You want to try again? Yes. <laughs> Buried. Buried. Here? Oh. It's saying yes. Well, I don't know. Well, as you can tell, this is not your normal walk in the park. No, this this is a surprise tonight. And it definitely warrants research. It's a challenge when we meet these things because proving them is the other side of that. Is there an exact spot? Is it here in this park? In this place? Yes. Can you take me to the spot? It's going back toward that hill. There's a ravine right before it. I don't think this could have been real recent though. Could it? Anything's possible. Come on, Mama, take us there. Spot. Just give us confirmation, that's all. We will do everything we can to help you. and a creek about 15 yards ahead of you there so it's all muddy brushy a lot of trash down in that I'm just looking at the rock do you have a first name are you willing to give us your first name Keep an eye on the box. I'm watching the box. If you can tell the box your name, that'll help us. It's getting ready to spike again. It's turning orange and the bars are growing. So. It went right. What's your name, Mama? I thought it said always, but it's A L M A Y S Almas 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 Almas. I don't know if that's having trouble. Is that right? Almay Almays. It's close. It's not. It's Do you not want to exact. Try again? It's trying. You want to try again? Oh, it's just swinging. Look, she's frustrated. You know, this wears on energy on everything when they're it's trying okay. to communicate this strong. It's okay, Mama. We've got time. She's frustrated. It's okay. Just relax. It says We're can't. We're here to help. It's okay. It says can't relax. It's okay. Whether it's can't relax or can't communicate, I was getting confused. Grandmother? Are you the grandmother? I think there was a baby involved, like a pregnancy or a baby... She says yes. So, okay. I'm gonna, I don't know how swampy this is. That's pretty soft right down where you're going. We Let's go around. go around it a little bit. Just keep trying to communicate. We understand. Just relax. Okay. We're with you. That whole thing to your right is all mud it and a is. bog. I can see it in the dark. So maybe definitely got to come back out in the here day. in the daytime. Why don't we plan to do that? Because there's not much we can do to help her tonight. Mama, That'll we're going to come back in the daytime where we can see, okay? 
that will give us time to research a little bit of it and try to build some kind of fact behind what we're being given. Don't be frustrated. We won't forget you. She feels like she's going to be forgotten again. It says tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow. I promise. I promise. Relax. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. Tomorrow. So, you know, the thing about spirit is something that's important to understand is we place a lot of energy and we, we vest a lot of our interest in the afterlife while we're alive. and. We understand that source. Jaden, I'm sorry to interrupt Jayden. you. Jaden, okay. Jaden. Keep that with Anthony. Anthony and, and Jaden. Says both. Both, Anthony and Jaden. We'll remember that, Mama. Good job. So, what I started to say, or what was coming across me, is it's very important to realize that just because a spirit has passed over doesn't mean that source. God, you know, whatever we connect with in that one, it doesn't mean that that energy cares any less for that soul or that aspect of a soul just because it's not in the physical body. And oftentimes I have found... I want to interrupt one more time. It's okay. They are England. Is that a last name? Is their last name England? Because it says England and it says they are. They are England. Is that a last name? No. Did you mean to say England? English. 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 They're English. This may be a little older than she realizes. Time gets away from spirits. But, long story short, just remember that Source doesn't quit caring about those aspects of self that haven't come back home yet. And part of what I have felt committed to do as opportunities arise is to let these energies get back home. Even if we don't solve what happened here, if it's been <laughs> I hate to say, possibly a hundred years ago, a little less. That doesn't mean that we can't help get those souls back home. So, let's see what happens tomorrow. Time doesn't measure the same for them in their realm. What no. might seem like five years to them might be 50 years or a hundred years to us. I think it's an old biblical saying, a day, on, a day in heaven is a thousand years on earth, you know. It's just there's no sense of time. But, okay. It says psychopath now. Oh, Lord. Well, this is getting very interesting. This is my <laughs> arena. Right. <laughs> You're silly. I'm going to put my hunting boots on. And it may be that she continues to try to communicate. But I have a feeling we're going to have more tomorrow, if not tonight. All right, Mama. I, think we're I just gonna, saw something shining in <clears> front of me. I think we're going to walk around for just a few minutes longer. Let's go straight up. There was <laughs> In the woods, I would have called it eye shine, but it was too low. And the box is chattering now. I've got the volume turned off just because it's well, so annoying for everyone to, to listen. She, maybe we're getting closer to where she is and it's easier. It says pond. Well, that was kind of a pond that ran right off, front of us. and they filled it in. Right um, in. I don't know. You want to point, Mom? I doubt that the camera will show the water shine that's over there. Maybe that's what I saw shining. But this drainage used to go into a little sediment pond, and it was filled oh, in. She's crossing right here. Right here. But she's you see crossing. how all that runs into that low right there? Oh. They crossed here. So X marks the spot. It's just okay. It says devil on here now. Okay, Mama. Wow. 
okay, Mama. It's going to be okay. So this used to be a pond. This whole section right here had been a pond, and you can tell where it's been backfilled. Mm -hmm. And that drainage all ran into it. It'll be easier for them to see during the day, too. Anything else, Mama? <laughs> I get this distinct feeling of she wants to say, I'm just getting started. Yeah. <laughs> and she's got an ear to hear what she's saying now. She's going to talk as long as she can. It tends to go that way. She says yes. Intuitively, I get this, like... I've been waiting so long, you know. <laughs> Anything else here? Are you all in one spot? And this She's is about, crossing right here. It's all through right this here. This is about as far as we can go without jumping that creek and then you're knee deep in mud and, and that water, yeah. water and So I'm right here between these big trees. We'll just remember this tree. It won't be hard to forget it. It's right down at the bottom of the hill. Hard to forget it. Hard to. Won't be hard it won't to remember. Be hard to remember it. Yeah, you understood yes. what I mean. Okay, mom, you can tell your story. Yes, she says yes. Whew. Give me a second here. I'm going blind. Thank you. Okay, so I think we'll continue this tomorrow. Um, <laughs> I'm still seeing spots from that light, sorry. It'll be a little easier for everybody to see what we're working with and um, the response that we're getting from the rods. But I thank you for coming with like share and subscribe please come along with us again and let's see what we find good night